Hello everyone, Mr. Happy here, and in this video I want to do something that I saw my good buddy Ethis doing over on his YouTube channel, and that is soloing as many bosses in Final Fantasy XIV as possible. Now, his video was soloing all bosses in Final Fantasy XIV, A Realm Reborn. I'm not going to take quite the same approach, but I did get this idea from Ethis' video series. So if you haven't watched Ethis try to solo all the bosses in Final Fantasy XIV, A Realm Reborn, you might want to go watch those videos over on his YouTube channel, on top of all the lore stuff. So, uh, I got the feeling to do this on stream earlier today and I was doing it it was a lot of fun so I figured you know what I don't have time to solo all these bosses on stream so how about I just make a, a series of YouTube videos at least attempting to solo certain things like certain things I'm gonna get completely destroyed on but regardless I'm at least gonna give it a shot so a little different from at this uh, he did it all on Dragoon while I could definitely do quite a few things on ninja you know my ninjas extremely well geared uh, the thing is his if his Dragoon couldn't do it my ninja probably can't uh, I have things like Shade Shift, but he's got Bloodbath, Life Surge, and if he's dying to certain uh, some of these things, it's going to be just utter chaos. So I'm going to actually start this one kind of on the far end. I'm going to be looking at some of the trials, like Ifrit Garuda. Um, a Titan I can't solo. I already know that one. Uh, I don't think it's possible to solo Titan hard mode. I probably have a better chance at, at farming Titan, ex at uh, soloing Titan Extreme, but not really. Um, things like the Relic Reborn quests, uh, the first coil. I'm going to be looking at that. I'm going to be doing it as my Astrologian, uh, just because it's the only healer I really have at 60. Otherwise, I would be using a Scholar for sure. If I was a level 60 Scholar, I would absolutely be using that instead. All right, so, uh, I mean, I'm not going to bother with any of these dungeons. Um, the hard mode dungeons, I'm actually going to try at some point. But for now, I'm going to start with trials. If you guys want me to do hard mode dungeons, if you guys want to see me go smash the low-level dungeons, let me know. Now, in case you're wondering how you can do this, how you can quote-unquote solo a dungeon or go into a dungeon alone, there's a little cog right here in the top right of your duty finder. That's all you got to use. And uh, just go to that. Go to participation requirements and check undersized party. This will disable level sinks and item level sinks, but it'll also make it so you don't get drops from enemies. They don't get EXP from enemies. And uh, certain duties it doesn't work on, as well as you still get loot from the chests. Like, for example, like if I go over to Alexander, uh, Labyrinth of the Ancients, it doesn't work. Uh, any of the Heavens Word Trials, it doesn't work. But most of this stuff, it works. So I say that we'll start on the list. We'll start with the low level stuff, you know, Ifrit normal, even Ifrit, uh, uh, even Titan normal, which is kind of a rough one. I probably have better luck on that on my ninja as opposed to doing that on my astrologian but we'll see how it goes uh, i'll just go down the trial list to start i've done some of the level 50 trials as is uh like i did turn two earlier which i'll probably try again some point in this video series i want to try if hard mode get rid of hard mode all that stuff i just don't want to do the low level dungeons like this stuff this i'll blow through in like two seconds you know what i mean like i don't even i don't even need friggin protector stone skin or any of that stuff for this because this guy look look how much health he's gonna lose like See what I mean? Like, do I really need to be worried? Now watch. Imagine he could, like, just end the fight, like, right here. Yeah, if I was my ninja, it would already be over. <laughs> and see? Man, to think of how much damage you got to do to this guy on, uh... On, I don't care about the other way. Imagine all the stuff you got to do to that guy. Like, how long that fight usually lasts when you actually try to do it. Um, you know, I don't think I can solo Titan Hard Mode as... This. I'm actually gonna go ninja. I'm lagging a little bit tonight, so you guys are gonna you're gonna see uh, some mudras that don't look so clean. It's okay though. I'm gonna be switching. Like if I can do it on ninja, these low level ones. Like if I can do it on ninja, I'd rather just do it on ninja. It'll be over so much quicker. I don't really need healing for these pre-50 ones. Like Garuda hard mode, really? Am I gonna need healing for Garuda hard mode? All right. Like so the thing is here, if I get jailed once, it's over pretty much. Because there's nothing I can do. Okay. That did, <laughs> that's uh, that's interesting. I maybe shouldn't have used so many cooldowns there then. Why am I standing at the edge as if... Can I just phase him over and over again and like never have to do a mechanic? Like, I'm pretty sure I don't ever have to do a mechanic here. Maybe I can just do this. Oh, whoops. That was, that was bad. Also, I kind of need to have sneak attack on my bar for this. Like, there, I should honestly have sneak attack on my bar if I'm going to do this as ninja. There's no reason to not have it, you know what I mean? Alright, Titan. Let me get a combo ready for when you become uninvincible. Yeah, this is... Okay, this fight's... This is easy. Yeah, okay, that was easy. For some reason, somebody asked me to do Titan normal as if it was going to be, like, really hard. As if I wasn't going to beat it before... The friggin' thing came out, I was like, okay. 
I don't know if I wasn't supposed to be able to beat that in time. All right, now we'll go to Garuda. Then I'll do Cape Westwind. Cape Westwind. I'm, I'm thinking about how long that takes to do. I think I might want to run Astro for Cape Westwind. And from Cape Westwind on, I probably just want to stay as a healer. <laughs> I still have Hudon from the last fight. Man, to think Garuda Normal is like the hardest version of all of them. You know what I mean? She actually has quite a bit of health, too. But, uh, as you can probably figure out, I'm not particularly worried about this fight. I'm not even... I'm saving my cooldowns. Is that the phase? Did you just jump? Oh, yeah, like, I'm gonna... D Imagine this kills me. Yo, come on, one shot. Mitchell Funk. That actually does, like, 2,500 damage. I'm impressed. When does she phase? Does she go to a 50? I don't even know. Does she go up at 40? Okay, I was gonna say, like, she's gotta do something here. Eventually. Oh, okay, she still hasn't phased. Okay, now she's phased. Like, what the heck? <laughs> she phases so fast. I guess that's... I'm never really used to seeing her at 34% by the time we get to this point. Oh, man. That 1200, though, like... What would I do? What would I ever do? Man, I don't know if I'm gonna make it, guys. I don't know if I'll make it for this armor crush, maybe. Man, armor crush is always against me. Whenever I try to do it at the one second mark. Alright, Garuda, I had a feeling the three normal mode primals would be pretty easy. It's the hard modes where things get interesting. And like I said, I don't think I can solo Titan hard mode. Garuda hard mode and Ifrit hard mode I'm pretty confident in. Um, especially because I did turn 2 earlier, and I did Relic Reborn Chimera, which is, granted, easier than the hard mode primals. But from this point on, I think I'm going to have to run Astro. Alright. Let's go for Cape Westwind next. If a Chrysalis also, I don't know if, I don't think I can solo the Chrysalis. I don't know, like, the Chrysalis was towards the end of the level 50 life cycle of the game. Like, I'd imagine that's, like, scaled to a point where it would be pretty hard for me to do, right? It's gotta be. That's gotta be too hard. But we'll give it a shot anyway. Alright, let's just get the stone skin, get the protect. I might as well, like, use these tools now that I have them. Normally, I would wait till I get, like, a crit shield, but I'm not gonna do that. I'll just go with this. Alright. How much health do you have? That's the real question. How much health does Rotaten Sas Arvina have? He actually has quite a bit. He also can't land hits on me for shit, so I'm not really worried. <laughs> He's got quite a bit of health. He's got a lot more health than I thought he did, to be honest. He also can't do anything to me, though, so I guess it doesn't really matter. The adds will maybe be, will maybe be a little annoying. So what attacks does this guy actually have? Like, <laughs> I like how he's just looking at me. Like, you just kick... Like, you have these giant things attached to your arms, and you're just kicking me. Like, I don't understand. Like, I'm at, like... I'm missing some health, guys. Maybe he'll get me. Oh man, I better use the Sable. <laughs> like, I might even just kill the adds when they come out, just so I don't have to deal with them. Just so I don't have to deal with them. Alright. I think I'll throw a heal on myself here. Might as well keep myself topped off with, uh, with regens as Astro. Actually got, like, I didn't realize he had so many different attacks. Also, I'm standing in fire. I think this is taking longer to do than Chimera even did. But you guys will see in a little bit. The balance. That's what I'm talking about. That's going to speed things up. I'm going to have to use Malefic 1. Like, I'm just running out of MP. See, that's the thing. Like, if I was a Scholar, I would not be having MP issues right now. <laughs> that's, that's so strange that I, like, have MP issues as this job. When I know for a fact that other people do not have MP issues. And these guys have quite a bit of health, too. Am I not wearing the right gear? Am I not wearing the right stuff? Like, this almost feels harder than, uh, than turn 2 was. I'm not even kidding, guys. I think turn 2 might be harder than this. <laughs> You're laughing, but, like, I've, I've soloed turn 2 in Chimera before. And I did not have to try nearly as hard as I'm trying right now. Like, I'm running out of MP like crazy here. It might be... I think it's going to be easier if I just kill off the cohorts. Also, these firebombs. 
annoying as hell, yo. He's got shield bashes? Like, he's not messing around. Nah, actually, I think it would have been faster for me to just kill him, because these guys have, like, Rampart and stuff. I'm gonna need to draw, like, an Ur or something. Never thought I'd, never thought I'd hear the day, right? Alright, and a, a, and a lengthened bowl is also really good. I'm just gonna do double hots real quick. Just make sure that I get the hot on me. There we go. That's the thing, as a as an Astro solo, I can't use Sinistry either. So it's like I'm pretty sunk when it comes to dealing with like or trying to get like enhanced heals on myself. That's why the other healers are definitely better for this. But hey, maybe some people want to see an Astro solo stuff. Alright. Well, Aspire. That's that's not particularly useful here. Uh, I think I'll just kill one. I think I'll put all the rest of my efforts onto him. I really do need an Ur, though. Like, it's pretty scary how much I need an Ur right now. Because, I mean, I can Malefic one for a pretty long time before running out of MP. Which is pretty much what I have to do. Like, I don't even want to put up my other dots. I just want to put up, like, this one dot and that's it. Your defeat will... <laughs> yeah. I don't know about my defeat, buddy. I don't know if we can really talk about defeat right now. Uh, you know what? I'm actually gonna do that. I want to shorten the cooldown of that by a pretty considerable amount. Also, of that uh, essential dignity. Oh shit, that's right, he's got AoEs. Oh, that does like 2,000 damage too, what the hell? Stuff that does damage, this isn't supposed to happen. <laughs> Again, we'll just do this. Yeah, I mean, this is an easy fight, it's just... I'm surprised at how long it takes to kill him as opposed to how long it took to kill Chimera. I'm genuinely surprised. Did they, did, did they like, ever buff this guy's health or something? And then as soon as he fires the last missile, if I want to take less damage, I can just run away. Is that how it works? Maybe that's not how it works. I'm assuming they're just going to land where he was. And he keeps firing these fire bombs at me. That's not appreciated. At least with Malefic 1, I can, like, do this forever. <laughs> yeah, he's readying more Magitek missiles. Do that all you want, buddy. As long as I keep drawing Spires, we'll do this all day. Um, I guess I'll put that up. Oh, shit. <laughs> it came back. <laughs> For some reason, I wasn't expecting that. Alright, so I learned a lesson here. Don't kill the adds, and use Malefic 1. You'll last longer. Other than that, easy fight, easy life. Come on. Man, I didn't get a single Ur. I'm, I'm, actually, I'm really surprised. Like, I, Then again, yeah, when I was soloing Chimera, I actually did get quite a bit of Ur's. And he is dead. Dead. Alright, Rattatan. Thank you for the challenge. But we're moving down the list. Alright, so what's next on the list? Chry Dude, Chrysalis, after that, do we really think... Like, Chrysalis isn't going to be possible. I'll still give it, I'll still give it a shot, because I'm just going down the list. Failure or not. Okay, I think Chrysalis will last, like, maybe 5%. Maybe the first double spark. I think that might be as far as I can go. Alright, let me... I need... I'm gonna start with a crit shield here. He's gonna hit me really hard. Like, if I... Maybe maybe if I get an I-210 weapon? <laughs> maybe I'll just ask my raid group, like, hey... Would you mind if I, you know... Got the first astrometer? Why? Well, I'm trying to solo the Chrysalis, and I really need to... No, no, you can't have it. But, I mean, the White Mage already has a weapon. I haven't gotten a weapon yet. Why can't I just have it? <laughs> yeah, I don't think that'll fly. I got 40 seconds on ether. I'm going to wait for my draw right here. And then I'll, <laughs> I'll attempt the fight. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Also, I'm going to need to try and get this... Oh, whoops. That's right. Maybe shouldn't have switched back until... I had known. 
The arrow, huh? Spear? That's not so bad. Um, I gotta use that right right at the start, though. Oh, no, I can't. Um, Alright, I'll just use it now. And I'll just try and get certain things off cooldown. We'll also Malefic 1 again. Yeah, like right here. I'm gonna get... Um... I don't know why I'm doing this. It's a waste of MP, actually. Get that off cooldown. Get that off cooldown. Get that off cooldown. I should probably not switch back. <laughs> the spark actually hurts quite a bit. Not enough to really scare me. Oh, the orbs. How am I going to do the orbs alone? Alright, I might as well just... Like, I think we're all pretty much in content that this is not going to end well, no matter what I do. So, <laughs> I think maybe, <laughs> maybe I should just, like, <laughs> I uh, should maybe actually just pay attention. Alright. So that's two, that's two defensive cooldowns now. <laughs> if we want to call them defensive cooldowns, sure. Alright. He's got a lot. I mean, it lasted longer than 5%, right? At least these can't crit. Oh, God. <laughs> he could have killed me with a fire one cast right there. This is, uh... This one might take a while, guys, because... You know what's, you know what's funny? It's, it's gonna take longer, because I actually thought I would have died by now. I'm actually gonna be able to make it to the first phase. Alright. <laughs> there. <laughs> That's me mitigating Spark. I'm so clever, guys. This is a this is an intense battle. I don't know about you guys, but I'm I'm starting to sweat over here. I'm feeling I'm feeling the intensity right now. So he gets two spells off and then he casts double. Like, that's pretty much his rotation in a nutshell. Um uh, Spear? Uh, that's pretty useless, but I guess I can use it on Disable. Oh, uh, wow, that enhanced. That enhanced so useless. Uh, I just. I shouldn't have switched there. Get some dots up. Alright. Here, I definitely need to, like, do something. Yeah, that's gotta be closer. Like I can't be I can't be cutting it that close. Is he gonna when does he face Okay. So for this phase <laughs> for Well maybe it'll be easier, because I won't have anybody to deal with except myself. I just gotta sprint, right? Yeah, see? I got this. Oh god. <laughs> this is gonna get bad. Also, I couldn't tell the difference between that one. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> Guys. I think you got a stack. <laughs> oh god, double stack. Oh god. Oh no. So I think okay, I think I might I think I might have lost. Guys, I, I there's a slight chance I may have lost the fight. <laughs> I I think he might have like 40 stacks right now, so <laughs> I uh, I don't know. <laughs> he might have like 40 stacks. I didn't focus on him. Hey, I lived. Oh no, this is doable. Does he have an enrage? The stacks are gone now. Like, I can just... Oh, okay, this is working better than it should have. Okay, I'm gonna admit, I don't think I can do one of the phases. I think you guys might know the phase I'm talking about. <laughs> I, uh... I'm honestly surprised to be alive right now. <laughs> did he just double? Yes, he did. I'm, uh, I'm a little surprised I'm alive right now. <laughs> All right, I don't think I should. I should try to go all the way because we're gonna be here forever. And I think we all already know the results. Uh, that was a bad time to light speed because I'm gonna have to cancel it if I want to do DPS right here. Can I get him one ur, please? Like I could really use one. 
Oh, there we go. This is pretty funny. I'm not gonna lie, this is pretty funny. <laughs> I can't wait till I get the triple, guys. I mean, I could Red Mage style him, right? Where I just take the entire instance and just, like, dot him up to death. That's how Red Mages did it in 11. Sometimes, actually, sometimes they would equip weapons that just barely did damage. That was another strat. I actually get a lot more damage on him in this phase because of his teleporting. He spends, he spends time, like, not doing any damage to me, and it's really nice. He's going to double me right now, though. But see, we got the cooldown usages now. I've watched enough of our scholars do A4 Savage to know how to heal myself in between getting hit by stuff. <laughs> like, from this point on, I like, don't need to heal until the next double. That's what's nice. Okay. There we go. I'm feeling it, guys. I'm feeling it. Here comes the next double. I actually should have used that spear, to be honest. <sighs> what is this? I gotta use it right away, too. It's alright. We're getting him down. <laughs> Can I do the second phase? Can I do the second half phase? <laughs> the thing is, there's no way I'm going to be able to do the very, very, you know, the uh, the DPS check at the end. There's no way I'm going to be able to do that. Unless, even if I draw a balance and, like, go super, go super saiyan with it, like, there's no way. Alright, that's actually really good. I gotta say, he's not very MP intensive, though. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, this this outside of that one phase might be easier than doing it in the Duty Finder. It might be. I feel like I'm doing a meaningful amount of damage to him. My DPS is probably like 400 right now. <laughs> to be honest, my DPS is probably like 400 right now. If I had to estimate, that's about where I would put it. If even that much, to be honest. <laughs> uh, let's do light speed. I just get those two heals out with light speed, and then we're back. If I was a scholar, maybe I could do it. <laughs> no, I don't think scholar could do it either, to be honest. <laughs> At least I know his ability rotation. That's something I never bothered to learn in the past. The balance. I mean, it's an AoE balance. That's kind of shitty. It also didn't come in the best spot, because this is not where I can really afford to use a balance. I'm just going to extend the duration of everything. That way I still have this balance going. I want to see if I can make it to the next to the next ad phase. Ugh, I can't use Malphic 2. I keep forgetting. I can't afford to use Malphic 2 MP-wise. Not unless I draw some extra Ewers. Okay, I get, what, like, maybe 9 GCDs on him damage-wise before I can't do anymore because of a double. I mean, I could technically survive double. Like, I'm playing it super cautious with it. I could technically just do this, what I'm going to do right here. And I should actually be fine to then just leave it alone. Like, yeah, I mean, I'll take that, but for now, at least I'm safe. I really wish I was a scholar right now. <laughs> My MP levels are so low. And I'm barely doing anything. Uh, this is actually not so bad. Oh, God, he's doing triples. Okay, triples I can't fuck around with. Triples I actually need be paying attention for. Yeah, like triples I absolutely need to be paying attention for. Those hurt way too much for me to not pay attention to them. Okay. We're still on <laughs> we're still on track though. Oh this is even better though. Like I've got way more time to DPS in here without taking any damage. It's gonna be a spark and then a triple I think afterwards though. Which is not good. Yeah, it's a triple. I'm actually just going to use this. Yeah. 
That worked out. I, I there was one that was one misheal in there. Does he just tell? Okay, then he sparks me again. Oh, so it's gonna be triple spark teleport now. Okay, as long as it's not triple spark triple, we should be fine. I am also. Oh, it is triple spark triple. Shit, I don't have the MP for this triple. Okay, I guess I do with light speed, but I kind of got to chill out now. I'm actually going to save that and enhance it. Like, here's the thing. I have no MP now <laughs> to deal with the freaking triple. Alright. Just got to play it safe, guys. Just got to play it safe. Dots all day. If I just do dots and then heal through the triple, I should be okay. Got the Ur stored away. I'm about to get my other card. Oh god, that does so much. Okay, let's get a good enhancement. Okay, that's actually pretty good. Extended? I'll take it. Alright, now I can get some dots up. Ugh, not many. Not many before a triple. I do have an essential dignity here though. So I can get one more cast off. Yeah, it gets kind of hairy right there. Like, he could kill me with, like, one more. I also had the Sable there and didn't use it. <laughs> When's the next phase? <laughs> I can't remember when the next phase is. This is, guys, if... If you don't hear from me again, you know what happened. <laughs> Actually, I think I just overwrote my extended one. Oh, that's bad. I'm dead. I fucked that up so bad. I don't know why I did that. Oh, well. I can actually get to the next ad phase, but that was so stupid of me. I don't know why I thought that collective was going to be enough. Okay. Well, we can technically get to the second ad phase, although it takes a damn long time. Is it bad that I only want to level Scholar now just to do this as Scholar? Is that bad? Like, should I feel bad for that? <laughs> Alright, Steps of Faith. <laughs> this is, this, okay, this is impossible. This is actually impossible. Like, there's things that are improbable, and there are things that are impossible. This one's impossible. <laughs> Maybe in like 5.0 I'll be able to solo this, but I'm gonna I'm gonna figure that that's it's not possible right now. <laughs> okay, but I'm gonna take it seriously though. I'm gonna take it seriously, guys. Just just take it seriously with me, please. Yeah, and then I draw a double spire. Thank you, game. Okay. Just take it seriously with me. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. Here's gonna be the opening strat. We're gonna do this, and swift cast, that, and then as we're running away, we'll do that. And now we're gonna sprint back to the cannon. They seek to swarm the healers. <laughs> oh, you don't say. <laughs> they seek to swarm the healers. Oh, you don't say. I can definitely see that he is preparing to swarm the healer. They are definitely preparing to swarm the healer. Oh god, I needed to stop. Oh, you know what? Actually, looking at this, I might be able to do this. What the hell? Why can't I? I mean, I know why I can't, but like... <laughs> okay, guys. I, uh, here's the... Okay, new strat, guys. New strat. I'm gonna kite them in a circle, and I'm gonna cast dots on the boss. <laughs> no, I can hit them. I know you can hit them while they're while they're right next to you. I don't know why I'm having trouble with it right now. I've done it before. He's not, these mobs actually don't hit that hard, to be honest. <laughs> to be honest, if not for the fact that I'm being... I can't do anything. <laughs> this isn't as bad as it seems. It's there. You know what it is? It's different because the Beists, or whatever they're called, they usually come up to... Yeah, like... It, okay, so here's what I'm going to do, actually. I leave in the middle of the fight. I can't even... I can't even fail the fight that's right. I know. Yeah, I can't even fail the fight by dying. Like, I have to wait for... Oh, my God. I am so sorry. This was not a good idea. I take back my initial plan of thinking this was a good idea. This was not a good idea. Because now I have to wait for the entire thing. Yeah, well, okay. We'll see. <laughs> we'll, uh... We'll see. Maybe I can just, uh... DPS him down, you know? You know, if I die, they all... And then... Oh, no. When I res, they all come for me. That's right. This is, uh, this is not going to end well, guys. I mean, it's, it's, it's going alright. Like, I'm doing, 
I'm doing all right. Like, like I'm doing. Like on a scale of one to ten, this is a solid four. Like, let's be honest. I mean, that's you gotta admit that's that's pretty good. It's considering all things, it's pretty good. <laughs> all right, this is the part that I think is not gonna end well. Maybe the NPCs can handle it. Oh no, these NPCs are getting destroyed, dude. Okay, so what I should have done differently, and what I'll probably not have. Okay. <laughs> oh, wait. Can that be my strategy? <laughs> can that be my strategy? Will that work? Are they just gonna come for me now? Oh, yep, they're definitely coming for me. That strategy is not gonna work. Never mind. All right. Oh, you know what? Maybe though. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe now. I can do this. Uh, ow. This is not gonna end well. <laughs> so not gonna end well. <laughs> Oh my god, it's also just murdering this cannon, like, even if it was going to work, it is not going to work. Because <laughs> they just literally attack the cannons to death. Alright, well, wait, If I so if I die here, will these things go away, or will they stay? Here, just kill me. Because you saw half of those enemies disappeared. Like, I've got to be on to something with this, right? Okay, these enemies definitely not disappearing like the last ones. Okay, so here's the plan. I'm now going to let them come all the way back to the shortcut while I buff up. Ready for this? Okay, so now here they all come. <laughs> here they all come. <laughs> Look at them all just walking towards me. See, I'm just going to create a gap here. That's all I'm going to do. As soon as they get over here, I teleport up to the front. We're good to go. Utilize the shortcut. <laughs> Except for the one turtle. That guy is, uh... I don't think we're slowing that guy down all too... Oh, God. It's a... That didn't work. That didn't work, guys. I, uh, I needed to wait a little longer. That did not work. Mayday, mayday. That did not work. Mayday, mayday. You know what also doesn't work? The fact that, um... I don't have any cannons to destroy them with now. Okay, so... Confirmed? Probably not uh, gonna be happening. I might la See, here's the thing. I can't say I lasted till the end of the fight. Like, that's that doesn't count, dude. It does not count. I actually do some pretty good deeps on this guy, considering I've pretty much just been dotting him up. I, I feel pretty accomplished right now. Horde reinforcement. I'm sorry. I hadn't, de I hadn't dealt with the first 20 mobs that you assigned me to. Are you telling me there's more? You know, in all reality, I could just kill these guys. Uh, not that guy, though. I wonder if I could just, like, do this. How more? How much more effective is doing this than actually killing them? <laughs> That's all... Okay, not very effective. This is... This is not very effective. But, uh, nope, definitely not effective. than what I was doing. <laughs> to be fair, it is actually more effective. And then I can... The thing is, I can't kill myself to get my MP back, because it's not going to work here, so... I don't know what I'm supposed to do for that. I also don't think I'm going to be able to do the snares. <laughs> uh, please. Please MP. Please MP. Okay, we're dead. <laughs> okay. Okay, we got it. We're dead. Man, I, uh... I wish I could leave this, uh, I wish I could leave this early, but, unless it lets me do it right now, nope. Did that work? Oh, you can do it that way! Okay. So if you ever, guys, if you ever want to quit Steps of Faith <laughs> after a death, <laughs> there you go, we know how to do it. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna move on to the next one. Okay, next we have the Chimera. This one I know is possible, and I think the Hydra is possible too. But the Hydra is definitely a lot harder than the Chimera. I can get lucky with it, but I don't know that I will. Alright, so Chimera. Protect, Stone Skin. Give myself. 
This actually I needed that arrow. Fuck. I didn't want to do that. That's fine too. I'm gonna wait for my next card draw. Whether it's the Ur, Balance, Arrow, whatever. I'm just gonna get this prepared. Get this crit shield on me. And then as soon as I can draw my next card, I'm going. I don't even have like all my cooldowns back up. Like I don't have light speed, but this either. That's fine. He'll come back up in the middle of the fight. I'm going to be pulling in 7 seconds. It's going to suck not having Luminous Ether for the first however many seconds. If I draw a Spear here, I'm going to regret it. Okay, that I don't mind. That'll hold me over. Okay. Let's get the fight underway. I learned a lot of interesting things about this fight last time. <laughs> This guy does not have a lot of health, for example. Every Malefic is basically 1% on top of the uh, the dots that I have. And be when I'm just spamming Malefic 1, like, you guys can see, like, my MP does not go down, like, at all. It's the later phases that get pretty interesting, like, because you dodge a lot of attacks. Um, a balance. I'll actually use that. That was my fault. I actually don't even need to dodge those, for real, but I should. It's more damage I don't need to be taking. Like, that's, like, by that definition, I might as well not dodge that either, you know what I mean? Okay. We're making good progress. See what I mean, though? Does it not... Oh, that was my bad. Oh, I dodged it anyway. Apparently. And I actually save my stun for Ram's Breath. That's like the only thing that does any damage to me. Uh, let's see if I can get a different card. Spear? Okay. So I'm going to use that. And then... Now I can go pretty crazy with Malefic 2s, to be honest. Because so now I have the Uwar on top of my passive regen. For like another 20 seconds. Oh, that's the enhanced Ram's Voice. That was actually the one I wanted to stun. <laughs> Whoopsie. That's fine. It does see how it doesn't really do that much damage. I just gotta get rid of the slow. Oh, I didn't even get rid of the slow. Damn it. And Dragon's Voice I don't care about. Like, Dragon's Voice is an irrelevant, an irrelevant thing. Uh, I'm actually gonna just put that into the enhanced. See? It honestly doesn't even do that much more damage. My, uh, my Malefic 2s. It does enough to warrant the MP cost, but like warrant risking running out of, you know, he's just going to do it again, isn't he? I think he does it one more. Oh god, that's another Ram's voice that was pretty poorly timed. That's fine. It's, it doesn't do enough for me to really care. I do care a little bit. I just don't care a lot. I'm going to try and get an Uwer here. Uh, yeah. Uwer would be better than a bull. What the hell? Come on. Sh shuffle. Uh, spear works too. I'll use that. That's actually in a that's actually a really good spot to get the spear. Cause I just pulled this. That's a regular Ram's voice. I don't know why. I was dodging these on stream before. I'm just not dodging them now. It's probably because I know better. Like, yeah, I know that these things aren't gonna hurt me all that much. Oh shit. I almost didn't get used again. Hopefully I'm not lagging. Yeah. Okay. That's what I wanted. I didn't want that to get stunned, but like. Okay, here's where things get fun. Because I just compl I do completely ignore these orbs. Like, half the time they don't even matter. Why did I- did I just use that? No, I expanded it. Okay. I mean, I just wanted to get rid of it, to be honest. Yeah, see, like, that's pretty much what it is. It's just, I gotta use almost all my MP on actually killing him. And try to hold out between essential dignities. Spearing an essential dignity during these solos is a massive, massive help. Uh, yeah, that's the empowered one. Can't stop it. Doesn't matter, as you can see, but... This... Now, this orb is confusing. Like, I've actually dodged that orb a lot when soloing this, and I don't know how. Uh, I actually kind of wanted to save that, but that's fine. There's a light speed here. Why not? I haven't used it all fight. Just get the double dot going. See, I wish I, I just wish I had someone to sinister. Like, if I could bring my Chocobo into this, and I could just sinistry him. I mean, the DPS would also make it a lot easier. But you know what I mean. Like, I just wish I had a target I could sinistry. 
I've got some spare time to throw out some Malphic 2s. I can't wait to go back and do the turn 2 solo again. Uh, I'm actually just going to use that. Like, the Disables here I don't really need to time. The Disables I need to time on a lot of other fights. Like, on Hydra, I'm definitely going to need to try and time it for, like, the triple triumvirates. Whether it be directly after a triumvirate. See, I just dodged the initial hit. Like, sometimes it's so easy. Alright, my MP's fine on this fight. Uh, that, on the other hand, is not fine. See, yeah, no, he's lightning mode. He is lightning mode. Um, you know what? Let's shuffle that. Draw another arrow. Fantastic. Is he? Yeah, he's in lightning mode, so I don't need to use my stun. I want to save my stun for Ram's voice and actually try to use it this time. Alright, I have plenty of MP. I need to throw out, like, way more Malefic 2s. Like, I have 10,000 MP. That's way more MP than the last time I did this. Alright, come on. Ugh, this friggin' paralyzes and slows. The paralysis is sort of gone, man. Alright, I'm actually gonna chill out for a second here. I wanna get this stun off because I don't wanna deal with this. Yay, more MP, right? Come on, do it. There we go. Might as well use that too. I mean, it's 60 seconds of less damage taken. Like, I'm not gonna complain. <laughs> Although I am still complaining about myself using the bowl. Okay, I fully resist paralyzed now, like. <laughs> I think we're good. <laughs> My strategy is complete, ladies and gentlemen. Fully resist paralysis. Can't paralyze me anymore. Uh, I mean if it's Ram's voice, I can always move out, yeah. I had a feel I don't know why, I had a feeling he was gonna Ram's voice even though he was in dragon mode. He was in dragon mode. Orb, and then another one. I wonder how much health Chimera has. I don't remember. Like, I'm just noticing my casts are like 1.6k damage each, and I'm trying to, like, calculate it all out. That's right. Well, nothing I can do about that. Just gotta make sure it's not fatal. Dodge it anyway. <laughs> I love dodging these attacks. Honestly, when I'm doing these solos, like, if I ever need to kite, it feels okay. Oh, that sucks. Yeah. It feels okay to use, like, a, uh... A what's it called? Yeah, I might as well use this. To use, like, light speed to do damage. Like, if I need to run around in a circle for any of these solos, I think I might just resort to DPSing under light speed instead of, like, turning it off. Because I really, really, really need... To like be able to kite and move during some of these fights. Like, this isn't really one of those fights, but I mean, even still, we kind of admit it would be nice to be able to light speed and DPS at the same time. Like if I just did this, like, it's only it's what I lose 400 damage on it or something. Yeah, that's not so bad. It's better than doing no damage during the entire duration. All right, Chimera down. All right, this video has gone on about 40 minutes, guys, so I'm going to cut it off here and, uh, you know, start working on the next video. This is where the challenges come in, because from this point on, the solos are going to get harder and harder. Of course, we're going to have hard mode dungeons as well, so stay tuned for more solos as Astrologian, Ninja, whatever it is. If you guys want to see a specific job attempt to solo certain things, let me know. I only have 660s, but I am working on that, so just uh, be sure to put a comment under the uh, video. So anyway, thank you for watching. I will see you guys in the next video, and until then, take care.